let us see the question which is based on the concept of electronic configuration and bonding in the elements. So, it is given that element x with atomic number 17 and element y with atomic number 20 reacts with each other to form a divalent halide. So, we have to determine the position of x and y in the periodic table. Also, we have to determine that x is metal or non-metal, also y is metal or non-metal and also we have to find out the nature of bond formed between element x and element y. Also, we have to draw the electron dot diagram of the compound form between x and y. So, now first write down the electronic configuration of x. So, electronic configuration of x with atomic number 17 which is 2, 8, 7. Now, the electronic configuration of y with atomic number 20. which is 2, 8, 8, 2. So, now we have to determine the position of element x in the periodic table. So, from the electronic configuration, we know that the valence electron gives us an idea about the group number. So, element x belongs to the group 7. Also, number of shells gives us an idea about the number of period. So, element x belongs to the period 3. Also, for element y, let us say the electronic configuration. Here, the valence electrons are 2. So, it belongs to the group 2nd and there are 4 shells. Therefore, the, it belongs to the 4th period. Now, next question is element X is metal or non-metal. So, we know that the element with valence electrons 1, 2 or 3 is metal. Here, element X is having valency 7. So, element X is non-metal. Same for element Y. It is having valency 2. And then we know that the element with valency 1, 2 or 3 is metal. So, Y is metal. Next question is nature of bond formed between X and Y. The bond formed between the X and Y is ionic bond. We know that the ionic bond is formed when th there is a transfer of electrons. So, this bond formed between the X and Y when uh, element Y donates its electron to the X to complete its duplet. So, the bond formed between the X and Y is ionic bond. Next is the electron dot diagram. So, X, Y. X. So, the valency of X is 7. So, here 7 electrons this also here 7 electrons the valency of Y is 2. So, 2 electrons of Y. So, this is the electron dot diagram formed between X and Y.